Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm always running late. Literally story of my life. And I used to not be this person, but with this job I have been. So anyways, good morning or afternoon. No, it's morning, it's 10 a.m. I'm going to pick up Nairi. If you watched my bakery chit chat video vlog in Denver, Nairi was featured in that vlog. She's my bestie for the restie. Um, she's still out in Denver, but she had a couple days off and she's like, where should I go? And I was jokingly like, well, you could come visit me in Seattle. She's like, okay, I just listed for a flight. And I was like, what? Really? Okay. So I'm going to the airport right now to pick her up. Literally ugh, always out of breath. I just finished getting ready. I look like a hot mess though because I'm rushing, but okay. This is much better. Um, so yeah, I just finished getting ready and we're just going to spend the day in Seattle. And um, some of you guys have commented you want to see around Seattle proper. And I'm going to get you that content today. So we're going to have fun and stick around and join us as we explore Seattle for the day. Should I cut my hair to this length, you guys? Like right now, I've just been rushing so it's like tucked into my shirt. But low key, like a little blunt cut. I've done it before, but it was blonde back in college. But... I'm kind of rocking with it. What do you think? Let me know. Should I cut it? Should I chop it? Hi! Hello! Hi. Oh my gosh, it's been yeah. so long. Thank you, besties who get besties drinks. I literally love this girl with my whole heart. My whole heart. I love her to death. All right, guys, we officially made it to Pike's Place, the public market, and we're gonna try all the goodies, have such a good time. Oh, look at the water. That's weird. And bananas. And it literally sounds so good. Hey, guys. So we're at Pike's Place Market, and we're just looking around potentially getting flowers. Tulips are my favorite flower and Seattle's known for them. And you can get a dozen for 20 bucks, potentially. Um, we just stopped at one of the fruit and vegetable stands and got us some, what was it, muscat grapes? And they're pretty sweet and they're really good. And they were letting us try like slices of every fruit that they offered, super nice. And it's just a cool market. Like, yeah, it's touristy, but I haven't been in a long time. It's been a couple years since I've been trying new things. We are trying veggie hambao. We both got, I got veggie hambao and she got barbecue pork. Barbecue pork. Taste test. Look how fluffy. Oh my gosh. First bite. Mm really good mm -hmm. it looks really good and they were both five dollar fifty cents yum yum. yum yum give us some mm -hmm. all right mine kind of looks more like football let's see i'm scared if it's like <laughs> full of veggies Ooh. veggie yeah okay i'm gonna try this one Yum. Mm -hmm. okay, perfect. Nairi tells me that the donuts are really, they're a must. And we're gonna try them. We're gonna get a half dozen assorted of cinnamon, powdered, and sprinkled. There we go. <laughs> This is so cool though. It literally knows the items and put it up on the screen. That is so cool. This is so cool. We just finished some um, unintentional shopping and I didn't need anything, but, <laughs> but we left with some stuff. <laughs> we didn't need anything, but yeah, it was uh, quite a time. Um, so we just tried self-checkout for clothing for the first time. Like, 
you put so I got one pair of pants cargos and two shirts and you drop the items in this like I don't know bin area so loud you drop the items in the bin and somehow it miraculously like scans the items and it just knows what they are without even like having to scan without having to scan any tags it just knows what the items are sorry and um that was my first experience with anything like that totally like on <laughs> yeah honestly i think i only hit like three buttons and then put my credit card on the screen <laughs> that was crazy video <laughs> Cheers to best friends and best adventures. This is good. This is my first espresso, espresso martini. Big fan. So now we stopped to get some ramen. Hi. She got um, a mix of spicy and like savory ramen. And then I just got the savory garlic black ramen veggie of course with my tofu okay guys we just finished it we both decided that was the best ramen of our lives uh -oh. so good so good and we just had the most interesting bus ride experience <laughs> not gonna go into it but there's some animated characters on the bus but um anyways we decided while we're still in the city to check out seattle public library which is right there and it's been on my bucket list because it's supposed to be gorgeous and I want to get um, a second library card because if you know me, you know I like to read. And it's going to be fun. We're going to see and see what it's all about. <laughs> you guys, I'm geeking out at this library. We just signed up for a library card um, and I can connect it to the one I already have for where I'm living because there's two different public library systems in uh, Seattle, King County. And they have a world language section here. And the one thing at the library near me that I've been missing is German language. They have like a bunch of other languages except German. And here there's all this German section stuff. And I'm geeking out because one of my goals this year is to get better at speaking German and understanding it and all that stuff. So I'm happy. I know. And I just finished mine. I just did mine for free, I'm not gonna lie. Morning, Sky friends just realized didn't really give you guys an update last night so we left the city around like 6 30 and got back to my apartment and we just had a pizza dinner night and we watched the newest episode of love is blind and it was the altar episode and wow i was not expecting the outcome that happened this season like i feel like season six has been the most unhinged and has had the most drama um if you watch Love is Blind, comment your thoughts down below because I'm so curious everyone's thoughts and opinions. I'm not going to spoil anything, but definitely worth watching if you like the show. And anyways, so it's the next morning. Um, I'm actually on reserve today. And so me and Nairi, we're kind of just risk. We're just flying by the seat of our pants. We're finishing breakfast right now. And um, I ended up getting an assignment for airport standby. First, I was extended reserved. So basically... Instead of AM reserve, it would be 24 hour reserve, which happens from time to time. And then once I acknowledged that assignment, then I got an airport standby for 3.30 to 8.30 tonight. So we get the whole day, essentially the whole morning to like hang out and do whatever we want. So we're just eating some breakfast in my apartment right now. And then we're gonna hit the gym because we're both workout queens. Muscle mommies. And <laughs> muscle mommies, oh, fitness yeah. queens. And then we're going to work out, come back, get ready. And I just packed my bags because I'm good for four days. So we'll get ready. I'll meal prep. And then we're going to go get some coffee near me. And then run some errands and then head to the airport. Hey guys. Um, my hair looks bad, but 
So, okay, we finished breakfast, now we're at the gym, and we're gonna die doing legs and glutes. Pray for us. We finished our leg and glutes workout, and my legs were literally, like, shaking. And anyway, so we did, it was a 40 minute workout and we each did a 10 minute warm up. I did it on the bike, she was on the rower. So basically a 50 minute workout, but with how many breaks we were taking, it ended up being an hour. And then we just ran to CVS to get some cold medicine. We're gonna shower, get ready. And I have some errands I'm gonna run first. And then we're gonna go to a coffee shop. I have to switch into my uniform because I have airport standby later today in the afternoon. And so we're gonna hang out at the airport together and then she's gonna list for a flight back to Denver. Yeah, like, so we are exploring downtown in my neighborhood. Hi guys. Ice coffee? Yes, uh, what flavor did you get? Anise, anise, I don't know, something almond. The almond anise? Anise. How do you guys say it? Anise, anise, I don't know. Um, I got a lavender latte, my classic. When I see lavender syrup, I always have to go for it. And we're just like walking around, trying to find a cute little pastry shop. Um, ran some errands and I'm already in uniform ready to start the day and guys this is why I can't be an a.m. reserve because a.m. you get the early morning calls you're at the airport at like 6 6 a.m. even earlier 5 30 maybe and then now like the assignment I got today is a p.m. shift and I've like got my workout in this morning got our errands done got our coffee like we're having a productive morning and I just feel very zen so Anyways, that's what's going on right now. And then we'll catch up with you guys later when we're at the airport. Look at the sunlight right here. Ooh. What's it called? Um, Golden hour? Yeah. Bing, bing, boom. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna end this vlog here. Nairi and I Hi. say goodbye. We just got through security. I'm gonna start my shift and we gotta get this girl back home to Denver. So thanks so much for spending like the past two days with us. Hope you enjoyed our little Seattle vlog. Maybe next time I'll be in Denver visiting yes. her. <laughs> Catch you guys later, bye.